right, time to make a midnight snack. Hmm, nah, no chips or fruity pebbles, no popcorn, no rice. Actually, macaroni and cheese should be pretty nice. Hmm, this is gonna be tasty. All right, it's time to make some macaroni and cheese. Actually, my nose is kinda itchy. Ugh. Man, it itches. Ugh. Uh. All right, no one's looking. Uh, I guess I can pick my nose. All right. Hmm. Ugh, for the last time, Woody, I am not massaging your shoulders. Ah, uh, please, Roy. Please massage my shoulders. Uh, they've been hurting all day, and I can't reach it. <sighs> no, Wendy. I am not massaging them, okay? I don't know how to massage shoulders. And also... This is weird, that's kind of weird if you think about it. I just came down here to get a drink of water, okay? I did not do this to go massage somebody's shoulders. It's in the middle of the night, okay? No. Aw, come on, Roy. Please? No, Wendy. I am not massaging them. Ah, uh, well, this sucks, Roy. All I need is a shoulder massage. Just one. It'll only take about eight minutes or so. No, Wendy. I am not doing this. You didn't even do anything that I asked for today. Well, Roy, you, you do dangerous things, okay? That was something dangerous that you asked me for. I am not doing that. Aw, oh, come on, Wendy. It wasn't that bad. It was that bad. Uh, Roy, look. What the? Oh, yeah, that feels so nice. Get up in there. <sighs> oh, my God. Iggy, what are you doing? Iggy, that's disgusting. Oh, yeah, that feels so nice. Oh, oh, oh no. Uh, it, it's not what you think. Oh, it's not what you think? Then what were you doing? Yeah, what were you doing, Iggy? I, uh, uh, oh, I was scratching it, yeah. Oh, really? Oh, you were scratching it, were you? Oh, yeah, you were scratching it, definitely. Come on, Iggy, tell the truth. We know what you were doing. I, uh, uh I, I don't know what you guys are talking about. Just admit it, Iggy. You picked your nose. Yeah, just admit it. I, 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 okay, fine. I scratched, but it apparently was in the inside of my nose. There was no napkins, there was no paper towels, there were no tissues anywhere. So I, I picked my nose, okay? We knew it, Iggy. That's disgusting. Yeah, that's disgusting, Iggy. Yeah, so never do it again. Wait. Wendy. What? I think I know what we can do. What? I think we can blackmail him. What? Bl blackmail him? Yeah. You know how school's starting? Oh my god. Yeah, let's do it. Guys, I'm sorry, okay? I I tried to do it in private. I didn't know anybody was going to be up. I'm sorry. I I know you're not supposed to pick your nose, but I I just couldn't help myself, okay? Okay, Iggy. Let's see something real quick. We want something out of this. You want something out of this? Come on, man. I thought we were siblings. Ho oh, ho, we are siblings. But that doesn't mean that we can still get something out of you. You know that school is coming up. It would be a real shame if me and Wendy here, yeah, that's right, would happen to tell everybody at the school that you're a nose picker, right? You wouldn't want that. Wait, so you're gonna blackmail me? Ah, that's exactly right, Iggy. Isn't that right, Roy? Oh yeah. We want something. Wait, are you even sure that people are gonna listen to you? I mean, come on. It's the first day of school. Come on. Do you really think people are gonna listen to you? Iggy, I want you to take a good look at yourself. Look at you. I, I, I don't want to really say this, but you're you're pretty much a loser. Yeah, you're you're pretty much a loser, Iggy. People aren't gonna believe you. They would believe us. So, you're gonna do what we say. <gasps> That's kind of mean, but I I guess you're right. <gasps> what do you want? Well, Iggy, what you're gonna do is uh, well. Pretty much you're gonna be our personal assistant. Yeah, I like that, Roy. Yeah, it's a good idea. And you're gonna have to listen to us. You're gonna have to do whatever we say, or we're gonna tell everybody that you're a nose picker. <sighs> All right, fine. I'll be your personal assistant. 
Just don't tell anybody, please. Of course, Iggy. We won't tell anybody. But you're gonna have to be our personal assistant. By the way, Roy, how do you want to do this? Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, do you just want to do it where it's like an hour he helps me out and then an hour he helps you out and we just switch? Yeah, sure, why not? All right, you get him first. Oh, okay, see ya. See ya. Oh, man, this sucks. All right, Iggy, you're coming with me first. Wait, but how long are we going to do this for? Until we get bored of it, of course. Oh, come on, man. Well, Roy, you had me for an hour. So what are we going to do? <laughs> well, Iggy, I found this apple in the fridge. And I found something in Dad's closet. So I'm going to take this apple, I'm going to put it on your head, and I'm going to shoot it off with the crossbow. <laughs> yeah, let's do this. Wait, what? Yeah, so take this apple, <laughs> and, uh, and go over there, and uh, I'm going to go shoot it off with the crossbow. But, but... That's very dangerous. What if I get hurt? Dude, you won't get hurt, I promise. Dude, I'm gonna get hurt. Seriously hurt. D dude, you're not gonna get hurt. I'm a good aim. I might shoot you a couple of times by accident, but I'll get the apple, I promise. Uh, well, I hope the people who's watching this video never does this at all. Never do what we're gonna do here. It's for entertainment purposes only, okay? Iggy. They won't do it, okay? They're not gonna do it. Seriously, don't do it. Anyways, come on, go. Uh, okay. All right, Iggy. Are you ready for me to shoot this off of your head? Uh, not really, Roy. I'm, I'm kind of scared, actually. Oh, you'll be fine, Iggy. You'll be just fine. I won't hit you, okay? Plus, remember. All right, fine, Roy. Just, just make it quick. I will, Iggy. All right, three, two, one. Oh my god! I I actually lived! I lived! Oh, oh my gosh! I actually lived! Oh. I told you Iggy I was a good shot. Now come on. You're gonna do some more things. Come on, Iggy. You're gonna do all my chores. No, please! Um, Roy, your time is finally up with Iggy. It's already been an hour. Wait. Oh my gosh. You finally found somebody to shoot the apple off the head. Come on. Wait. Are you serious already? <sighs> All right, fine, go ahead. <sighs> uh, Iggy, are you okay? No, I'm not okay. He shot an apple off of my head, and surprisingly, I didn't get hurt. Please tell me you're not gonna do something like that, please. I, I'll do anything, please just don't do it. Don't worry, Iggy, I won't let you do that, okay? I'm not that extreme, okay? I'm not going to put you in life-threatening situations like that. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Come on, follow me. Oh, uh, okay. All right, Iggy, we're finally here. Oh, uh, Wendy, why are we at the couch? Well, Iggy, my shoulders have been hurting all day, and it just uh, it just hurts a lot. So, can you give me a massage? A uh, massage? Oh, man. Iggy, don't complain. I mean, you literally just got an apple shot off of your head over there. All right, this is way easier, okay? And if you keep complaining about it, then I'm gonna make you rub my feet, too. <sighs> all right, fine. <sighs> all right. Is this where you want it? Ah, uh, yeah, that feels nice. Uh, rub a little bit harder. <sighs> a little bit harder. Come on, put your back into it. Okay, fine. Uh, geez, this is gonna suck. <sighs> <sighs> All right, Roy. Here's your pretty pebbles. Oh, okay. Thank you, Iggy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. Uh, Roy, if, if you don't mind me asking, can can I go take a nap for the remainder of the time? Wait, what? Uh. <sighs> all right, fine. Go. I think this is all I need you for, anyway. So just just go. Go take your nap. Thank you, Roy. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. All right. Om, om, om. <sighs> I only get one hour. Just one what? hour of resting. I can't stand it anymore. I've done Roy's chores. I've, I've.
massaged Wendy's back too many times. I've even scrubbed her feet and that was disgusting. I haven't gotten any sleep for a whole day. <sighs> I'm so tired. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I love playing Pokemon. Oh, it's so fun. Oh, wait. That's a Machamp. Come on, come on. Wait. Wait, what? I don't get any sleep. No sleep. Uh, Iggy? Are, are you okay? <laughs> wait, wait, what? Oh, uh, hey, Lenny. Uh, are you okay, Iggy? You seem really sad for some reason. Oh, uh, I... I am sad, but... Hmm. Lenny, would you judge me if I told you something? Oh, of course not, Iggy. I would never judge somebody, especially a sibling. Oh, well. Okay, well. I guess I'll tell you. So, I was making macaroni and cheese. Okay. And, uh, my nose started to itch. Um, okay. And it wouldn't go away, so I, uh, I've sort of picked my nose. Oh, well, uh, yeah, you're fine. It's okay. I mean, sometimes we have to do it. I mean, there's no tissues or paper towels around, you know. You know how that happens. Oh, well, uh, that's nice that you're not judging me for it. Yeah, of course, Iggy. I would never judge you like that. But, uh, is that the reason why you're crying? Because you picked your nose? Oh, no, that's not the real reason. Uh, back to the story, uh, so I was picking my nose and then Wendy and Roy sort of caught me. Oh, well, that's, that's kind of awkward. Oh, yeah, it was pretty awkward. But, uh, the thing was, instead of being nice siblings, they sort of, uh, they sort of blackmailed me. Wait, they blackmailed you? But how? Oh, well, the way they blackmailed me was by saying that since it's two against one and people would believe them more than me, they said that they would go to school, and you know how school is starting up? They were going to tell everybody that I picked my nose. Wow, that's mean. You know, I would expect more from them because they're older than us, but I guess not. Oh, yeah, I did too, Lemmy. But no, apparently not. But uh, now I have to be their personal assistant for as long as they want. They never told me when this was going to end. I am so tired. I haven't slept in days. I have done too much. I I don't know what to do anymore. This this has gone too far. They They just keep running me to the core. They keep pushing me past my limits. I have been awake for a day now, and I haven't gotten any sleep at all. And I don't know what to do. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm so sorry, Iggy. Hmm. Well, there is one way to get back at him. Uh, wait, there is? T tell me, tell me, Lemmy. Well, Iggy, a way to get back at him is by catching them doing something that they're not supposed to do or something that they're doing is awkward. All we have to do is just catch them doing that and then it's two. And and then we just blackmail them back. And they can't do anything because now we're even. And they can't do anything and we can't do anything to them. Oh, wow, that's actually a great idea, Lemmy. Yeah, that sounds amazing. Oh, thank you so much, man. Oh, yeah, no problem, man. Yeah, so let's go have a stakeout. All right, let's do it. Well, Lemmy, what are you going to do first? Oh, well, uh, I'm about to go help Wendy out. Oh, okay. Well, this is the perfect time to catch her doing something bad. So, uh, just try and catch her doing something bad, I guess. Oh, well, that's very helpful, Lemmy. Lemmy, there you are. The what? I've been looking for you everywhere. All right, where have you been? Oh, hey, Lemmy. Oh, hey, Wendy. I was just leaving. Uh, uh okay. Uh, but where have you been, Iggy? Oh, I've been just, you know, I was taking a nap. Who said I could take a nap? Well, that doesn't matter anymore, because now you're going to go wash my feet. Oh, come on. All right, Iggy. Time to rub my feet. You know what to do. Wendy, how am I supposed to rub your feet? Your shoes are stitched on. Uh, what? Oh. Shut up, Iggy. Just, just rub my feet. Come on. <sighs> Fine.
Ah, that feels better. Uh, wait, hold up a second, Iggy. You can stop. Oh, okay. Uh, was I doing it too soft? No, Iggy, it was just fine. But I gotta leave for a second. Oh, okay, see ya. Oh, okay. Well, that was weird. Hey, Iggy, get over here. Uh, hey, Iggy, what's up? Uh, Wendy just left. I think she's gonna go do something. Maybe we should follow her. Oh, yeah, let's go follow her. All right, I'm coming. And that, Luigi, is why water is wet. Hmm. Can you repeat why again? Uh, you know what, Luigi? I'm not telling you again. You're not gonna get it. I'm just gonna go get a drink of water or something, okay? I'll be back. Okay, Bowser. Ah, sweet. Ah, now I got Dad's wallet. And now, ah, I can go get those new shoes. And then I can just put it back, and he won't even notice. Let's go do this. Oh my gosh, Iggy. What a thief. I know, right? Oh wait, she's coming this way. Come on, we gotta hide. All right. Ah oh, man, I'm gonna find some new shoes. Oh, they're gonna look amazing. Ah, this is gonna look great. Hey! W what the... Ah, crap. Hey, Wendy. What are you doing with Dad's wallet? Uh, he, he gave this to me. Wait, aren't you supposed to be down on the couch? Oh, really? It looks like he didn't give it to you. I think you stole it. <laughs> well, that's ridiculous, Iggy. I would never steal from Dad. So come on, go downstairs. And, you know, you're gonna massage my feet. No, Wendy. I'm not gonna massage your feet. You know what you did. Fess up. All right, fine, I did steal his wallet. But what are you going to do about it? It's my word against yours. Plus, Dad believes me more than you. You can't do anything. Oh, really? It's my word against yours? Hey, come here. Hey, Wendy. Wait, Lemmy, you're here? Why are you here? That's not really important, Wendy. What is important is that you stole Dad's wallet. Yeah. <sighs> all right, fine. <sighs> what do you want? Well, first of all, Wendy, I want you to put Dad's wallet back. Yeah, Wendy, stealing is wrong. And second, I don't want to be your personal assistant anymore. I'm done with this. Now we're even. <sighs> fine, I guess it is fair. Fine, I'll go put his wallet back and you won't be my personal assistant anymore. <sighs> fine. Ah, fine, Iggy. You win. That's right. Now go put it back. <sighs> and good riddance. Good job, Iggy. You did great. Thanks, man. So, Iggy, what are we going to do next? Well, Lemmy, I still got about 30 more minutes left before Roy gets me. So, we're going to go check on what Roy's doing. Uh, I'm kind of hungry. Let's make myself a sandwich. Hmm. Uh, all right. Let's see. All right, there's some salami, some cheese. Uh, let's get some mayo. All right, everything looks to be pretty good. All right, let's make a sandwich. Wait. <laughs> no one's looking. Oh, I got a great idea. All right, I'm finished. All right, I'm just gonna throw this all around the cabinets and then I'm gonna blame it on Morton. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Take this. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, the salami. <laughs> All right, let's see what. <sighs> Roy, what are you doing? <laughs> oh yeah. What? Uh, uh, it, it, it's not what you think. Uh. I came in here and it looked like this. I, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Roy, we saw you. What the heck, man? Yeah, what the heck, Roy? Uh, <clears throat> crap. All right, yes, I was going to do this and then I was going to blame it on Morton. Wow, Roy, why would you even do that? Because it's funny, obviously. Huh. Well, I guess Dad wouldn't want to hear this, right, Lemmy? Yeah, right. 
<sighs> yeah, I guess he wouldn't. All right, fine. What do you guys want? Well, first of all, Roy, uh, you're going to clean this whole entire kitchen up, and you're going to clean the mess. Yeah. And second of all, I don't want to be your personal assistant anymore. Uh, what? <sighs> all right, fine. That's fair. I'll clean this kitchen and... Fine, Iggy. You don't have to be my personal assistant anymore. I'll go clean it. Oh my god! I'm free! I'm finally free, Lemmy! Ah, uh, that's great to hear, buddy. Alright, let's go get some ice cream or something. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Ah, oh, jeez. Ah, well this sucks. I guess I'd better get to cleaning.